celebration of an exceptional leadership of our reigning champion and the first distinguished ranking member of the United States Congress, the Honorable Raja Krishnamurti. As many of you know, we've been introduced, reintroduced. Oh, I mean, uh, many uh, we know Raja as much as as a bag of the hand. That being said, Raja is truly a devoted, passionate, committed public servant who keeps every awakening movement in terms of finding ways to advance public policies, co-authoring co legislations, and legislative, pushing the legislative agenda that is comprehensively enhances the quality of life of the people of this, not only the state of Illinois, but not only the state of the Illinois, not only the state of the, not of the congressional district, but ladies and gentlemen, may I dare add the entire nation. And for that round of applause for Raja Kishimoto. His leadership has been a, his leadership has been exemplary as many of you who's been watching who watches news in the evening would know that the state of Illinois has about 17 congressmen. The only congressman that I as a avid uh, news uh, viewer see is Raja Krishnamurti on the front lines of the media talking about the issues, advancing the issues that make that are central to our lives. Ladies and gentlemen, that in a sense uh, is what Raja Krishnamurti is, truly stands for. That being said, I will now uh, set this uh, small event, informal event in motion by inviting first Shilpaji, the first lady of this house, Mahi Ashank Nishant Bikram said to formally give a, a flower bouquet to wow. the Congressman Raja Krishnamurti. We've been the recipient of his hospitality before when the Council General, the Ambassador uh, Nita Bhushanji and O.P. Singh was here. And that being said, I would like to, of course, formally invite uh, Harry Mohan, the man who is truly hosting this event's event. Yeah. He's an entrepreneur, he's an IT professional by, uh, by profession. Doing this, you know, and helping us out. Thank you so very much for coming in, everybody. Appreciate all your presence here. Thank you very much. I'm blessed and my family is really blessed. Thank you so much. Mm. Thanks, Gary. Thank you. And now, I, of course, uh, Harry also uh, arranged a nice musical evening following this formal event. Uh, he's guy actually, he flew in one of the finest singers this evening, and I'm sure you'll enjoy because we already enjoyed his uh, uh, music earlier at the uh, earlier reception. Please stick around and have your drinks and dinner. We will have a wonderful music even musical evening following this reception. That being said, uh, may, may I now invite uh, to this uh, informal podium? Uh, absolutely, sure. While he's uh, was taking the picture, may I invite? Mrs. Santosh, yeah. who has invited us, such a beautiful couple, and he has taken care of our other guests when Vinita Ji was here, Mr. Kupi Singh Sir. And today, very special thing, you know, Raja is our person. That's the only one I want to say. Raja is a very committed person, very well educated. You have to understand, many people stand for the positions without knowing what position required to be there mm -hmm. and how to sustain that position and how to bring the respect to the position. I think Raja is the right person to bring, to understand and to bring the respect to the position for the in whole Indian community, which is very, very important to understand. Because here we come with the dreams, all of, but we have to understand where we are fit in. He has been a law graduate, he has been an engineer, he has been a, in finance at a state level. So he knows the process very well and he knows how long he has to go. And I think he has prepared his wife because this is, politics is very, very difficult. Is it 24, but 26 hours job, not 24. And to sustain that and to work that hard is very remarkable, very commendable. We, we, we depend on you, whole community depend on you, Raja. Now, you have to take us to the respect of lives we have. That is your, I request you to do that. You want him to be because we are in a such a sometimes people don't understand India. They don't understand our culture. They don't understand the philosophy. They don't understand what India has given to the world and what it can give you, give them. Because all the civilization has gone. This is the only civilization which sustained forty eight civilization has gone in the drain. Very big. Babylon, Basitubania. Uh, uh, Chinese, Mayas, everything has gone. This has been sustained because of the value system. That you have to really 
make understand these American people that we are not ordinary, we are very special, and we are for the world, not for India only. Thank you so much. Thank you. This event together, and he's got a very sharp elbow, ladies and gentlemen, because he knows he has to collect the checks. And I think I think we're going to do very well this evening. Thanks to Ajit for his untiring leadership. <laughs> Yeah, Without Ajit, you know, actually, he's, uh, you know, among the uh, among the community leaders, I think, you know, let's say Ajit, Neil, Sunil, or Iftikhar Sharif, these are all the uh, the Sandoshi, of course, uh, uh, everybody. These are the frontline commanders of the community. Without them, I don't, I don't think the community truly really stands. These are the pillars, ladies and gentlemen. Please put your hands together for these wonderful people. Oh, and that being said. Let's get Ajit Absolutely. That, he's very shy about saying, Ajit, you should, should come. I think at the, at the request of Congressman, you must. By the way, we call so, him. Namaste. Good evening, everyone. Uh, uh, we collect so far $13,000. And which is good news. And I think um, uh, I need um, some more. I have few guys in my mind after I'm going to put this mic away, I'm going to come to them. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thanks, Ajit. Actually, I should say, uh, Ajit and Harry are the chair, chairman of the savings event. Now, that being said, uh, this evening, there's one gentleman who truly put his right foot forward in terms of assisting in this fundraising. Uh, none, is, none other than Neil Court, the wonderful dynamic yes. young man. Oh, come on, man. Oh, who really very silently gave a, a, a you know, good, uh, shall we say, considerable uh, support this evening. Ladies and gentlemen, Neil Khod. Neil Khod. All right. Thank you. We're extremely proud to be in presence of Raja. I mean, Raja makes us feel that our seat on the table is there. So whenever, from the many years we have seen him do public service, he's the one who really stands out for us. He's the one that when we need, his staff is there, whether it's uh, Brandon, then you got uh, Abisha, I forgot her name, Abi, Abila? Sabi. Sabi, Sabi, Sabi. So all of their, their staff has always been there on the forefront whenever we need it, and he has never shied away from that. Um, so round of applause for that, that whenever anybody has any problems, I'm sure his office has always been there. And and with that, his, his strides today, he's on the intelligence committee, from there he's now on the China committee, I think we really are proud that that he's going bounds and leaps. And I think you re truly represent who we are. As Santoji said, that please let the world know what India stands for. And, and you are the true representative of who we are. I mean, from, from all different angles that you represent, uh, everything. You're a lawyer, you're an engineer, you're a, a businessman, now you're a politician. So Indians are all mixed up these, these uh, different varieties. And you truly represent us at the national level. Extremely proud. I know that Modi ji is going to come come to United States, and we think you will be a great leader to to show our uh, showcase our uh, achievements and and the relation with India U.S. still needs to strengthen more. So with that, I said uh, a great collection has happened. We are we are proud. More always is there. Thank you. Uh, Raja truly. Uh represents the hopes and aspirations of the of the not only the, the current generation but the generation to come forward and that being said may I now, now may I now invite Mr. Iftikhar Sharif uh, the Iftikhar. Sorry, the man the man who is the first recipient of the PIO uh, Where is card OCI card card now <laughs> now it's OCI card ladies and gentlemen Iftikhar Sharif uh, good evening ladies and gentlemen it's a great honor and privilege to be among Mr. and Mrs. Hari Mohan First time I met, I'm very impressed with uh, his IT success and many other things, and a beautiful family. And it's a great honor to be among all the leaders and, uh, and all of you. And Raja and me, we've been working for, I don't know, gosh, maybe 15, 20 years when, uh, when he was the Illinois, Illinois State Controller, Assistant Controller, then we worked for Obama, then he went for Congress a few times, then he finally won. And now I just told him that uh, you're good for the next 20 years to be Congress or <laughs> Senator or whatnot. You got the money and we got the people and he touches the people at the ground level also. You know, the underprivileged and so forth he touches. And he's there everywhere, whenever the leaders from India comes, he's always there. And he's always been a secular person. As you all know, India is a 
secular country made up of Hindu, Muslim, Sikh, Christians and all of them. And that's what all I see in Raja. So Raja, thanks that uh, hopefully the Prime Minister's visit, you will be sitting next to him. And before that we have uh, another leader, hopefully he'll be the next Prime Minister, Prime uh, Rahul Gandhi is coming also this month actually. So uh, this is good for us that when the leaders come and leaders from here, they get together and makes a difference. So thank you. Long live Indo-American friendship and Jai Hind. Jai Hind. Jai Hind. So, would you like to add a couple of words? Sir? I'll say he is already A to Z. Everybody knows it and he is getting more and more popular because most of people know that he has been helping this way or that way to so many people when I hear about it. Thank you from everybody's side. I'm still waiting my side. But I'm sure. <laughs> But thank you for being what you are. We really appreciate your presence among us. Thank you. The APCL, American <laughs> Cricket League President, Subo here. Also Naresh, I will also acknowledge Venkat here. I will also acknowledge uh, Altaf, Manoj, and, and of course, Mr. Lucky, Mr. Lucky Sota and Jaswan. Uh, may I request uh, Mr. Lucky Sota to come and say a few words? Sorry. And may I also request Jaskaran Dhaliwalji also. Please come forward. Come. Thank you, Lakiji. Thank you, Jaskaran Dhaliwal. <laughs> what is this? We get to get a fresh start. When there is a job, I live in the house. But if you call them in the office, if you call them in the office, if you call them in the office, then you call them in the office. So, we need to move forward to such people. We need to move forward to our Indian community. बहुत काम लीडर हैं जो अमेरिकन पॉलिटिक्स में तो कम्युनिटी बहुत है लीडर काम है तो हम आपके साथ हैं जैसे हम आप हमारे साथ हैं हमेशा तो आगे बढ़ते जाएं हम आपके पीछे पीछे चलते जाएंगे और आपको सपोर्ट करते जाएंगे थैंक यू मैं रिक्वेस्ट दी यंग बॉलीवुड Promoter, the guy who hosts wonderful shows, he recently hosted a wonderful show with Javed Akhtar ji. Sorry, would you say a few words? Thank you so much, Kirti ji. Thank you so much, Harry Mohan ji and Hello. beautiful family. Thank you so much for beautiful people, for all this opportunity. Raja, sir, thank you so much for all that you do for us. And we are so inspired. I love the work that you've done so far. Thank you so much and we appreciate you very much. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Finest gentleman, the icon of the fashion icon, chairman of the Federation of Indian Association, <laughs> Mr. Sulisha. But before he comes here, I'd like to acknowledge Vinesh Virani, without whose support I don't think we could have done it. Vinesh, if you can please join for a couple of words, that will be wonderful. But we'll always keep the best for the last. <laughs> what can I say? You know, one of the finest leader we have. I know Raja since I think Obama time, 2004 or before when nuclear deal was happening. Yeah. So he's the one who I think convinced Senator at that time that he should sign this treaty. And we're always thankful to you. So Raja, you are the pride of a lot of people when, when we go to ask him for the some uh, contribution for Raja, they are happily give it to uh, you, especially in our Art of Living family. Wow. Uh, this time also they did great job, so wow. thank you. Thank you. Thank you. This gentleman of the community, the chairman of the Federation of Indian Association, the man who has got a huge following in the Federation of Indian Association, please put your hands together for none other than Mr. Chunil Suril Shah. Thanks, Kirti, for the kind introduction. I would like to compliment the gracious host, uh, Harry and Shilpa, for uh, organizing this beautiful event. And uh, with this newcomers coming, Raja, you would surely acknowledge that uh, we can say that I'm sure you all agree that Raja's Praja is becoming bigger and better. Yeah. <laughs> and it won't be an exaggeration if I would say that with Raja's passion, devotion, action, from Raja, Raja has become a Maharaja. <laughs> and because his expense speaks louder than the words. You know, uh, whenever we approach him, you know, the works get done. That's the most important thing. A small incident I would like to narrate before you. Just a week before, you know, uh, two of my friends, one is a dentist, one is a pulmonologist, 
they had been to Mecca, uh, you know, for the for the Hajj. They had gone, and due to some reason, they were kind of uh, caught by the policemen, and they were kept in the jail for about I would say seven days. And uh, one of their friends, they knew me. They called me, and and you know whom I approach? One eight hundred call Raja. <laughs> And uh, with that, uh, Raja's, uh, you know, uh, consistent efforts and all, and the things became much easier and they were released. And uh, it was a very happy reunion with the family. And this shows that, you know, we have our person, uh, you know, whom we can rely upon with fullest confidence that your work would be done. And that's none other than Raja. So I very meaningfully and very rightfully said, you know, what I mentioned before. So Raja, thank you very much for what you do for the community and we truly appreciate and uh, all the best. Thank you. Thanks. Anand Kalvakota, the landlord of Kandaj <laughs> Krishnamurti, otherwise he may get an eviction, right? <laughs> Sharad Kalvakota, man who is how, kind many, of how many speeches should I give? <laughs> uh, what should I say? Raja, you, you represent the, as uh, Santosh said, you represent us. And uh, he has done it thoroughly so far. Uh, I'll give you one example. Howdy, morning. Uh, I know people have difference of opinions and whatnot, right? He he did not he did not flinch. Uh, he came to Howdy, Modi, and uh, there was another uh, congressman, right? Uh, your minority leader now. Yeah, I, uh, that was in Houston. You were only two uh, con uh, Democrats, uh, congressmen actually. So standing. Yes, and whoever was there, right? Yes. So that shows that he cares for something, right? That's okay. Jisi ko mori le acha lagi na acha lagi. It doesn't matter. But somebody having that heart to say, you know what? I gotta go. Tomorrow Rahul is coming, so he'll go. At the end of the day, he represents us, and that, that's the reason we all are behind him. And you know, he's he's everywhere in the United States. So uh, I have friends from Austin. He made friendship with, uh, in one party, now the whole whole crew from Austin is after him. So <laughs> he's everywhere. And I wish him to be the next senator from Illinois. I'm, I'm, just, I'm, I'm sure he has all the potential and everything. So uh, again, whoever has uh, contributed, please try to see if you can contribute next month also. <laughs> hey! I approve that message. <laughs> I second the motion. <laughs> so that he could have a larger, uh, you know, in swath of uh, people under his leadership. Because I truly, he, he's as, as, ladies and gentlemen, let me, let me add saying that Raja Krishnamurti has arrived on the national political landscape. And as such, we would stop at nothing but in terms of promoting him, in terms of doing our part to ensure that, you know, he moves in to D.C. or maybe one day in Pennsylvania Avenue. Why not, right? Right? Absolutely. Yeah. Absolutely. So, that being said, now at the last speaker of the evening, uh, may I invite Sohail Danga, who is the Illinois Asian American Engineers Association President. Sohail, and after that, of course, we'll have a, a very beloved congressman to address all of us. Sohail Danga. Sohail Sharma. Sharma. Very glad to be here in the order. Um, in August, we're going to have our next event, and uh, you'll be our guest speaker, of course. Uh, it's a new association. We're trying to make more ways for all our engineers who are coming from India and they are trying to make a way. Thank you so much. Thank you. So Srinivas Reddy couldn't make it because of an emergency meeting in the Cook County Board uh, Health related issues. That being said, of course, he should be making way probably at late later tonight. But on behalf of Dr. Srinivas Reddy, we have Terence representing Dr. Srinivas Reddy. Thanks, Terence, for your for your uh, you know attendance and also for uh, bringing the you know the support. <laughs> and now, ladies and gentlemen, the final is the the finest hour has come. Please put your hands together for the Honorable Raja Krishnamurti. Yeah. Thank you so much. I'm so honored. Thank you to Harry and Shilpa and Mahi for uh, hosting us. Can you give them a big round of applause? And even though it's a little cool outside, I feel the warmth of this family. And I don't mean just the fires. I feel the warmth of our friendship. 
You know, you've been with me a long time, right? You were with me when I won the silver medal, and then when I took the gold. <laughs> it turns out, I was just looking at my phone, you know what today is? May 25th is Happy Towel Day. <laughs> but you never threw in the towel on me. Isn't that right? You were there every step. Regardless of whether I lost or whether I won, you were there. And to me, that's more important than anything. Yes. Your friendship, your presence, your blessings mean the world to me. And nothing can replace that. And that is why I am so honored to receive your support once again. I am now, thanks to you, a fourth term congressman in the United States Congress. And on top of that, I became uh, the ranking member of the Special Select Committee on China. Wow. This is the first time an Indian American has ever been a chair or ranking member of any full committee in the entire United States Congress. So we're breaking barriers and we're doing it together. I want to say thank you to Kirti for being a wonderful master of ceremonies. Of course, Harry, all of you, each and every single one of you, you know, from, uh, you know, um, Lucky, who, who has the best name among us, <laughs> Being lucky. To, to Iftikhar, Iftikhar, who is, a, I don't know if you knew that Iftikhar's first big business was processing credit cards. Credit card. yeah. And we need your help tonight. <laughs> Santosh G, did you know that she's opening a wellness university, Veda University? Yeah. Have you been there? Yep. This yes. is really yeah. tremendous. I, give her a big round of applause. I was there last week. I could not believe it. And you know what they've called it? Mini. Santosh land. <laughs> we need a land full of Santosh G's. Am I right about that? Yeah. Yeah. No, that, is, that is and, and of course we have Sunil Shah and Neil Code, the best dressed people <laughs> in Illinois at this point. Ajit and Ajit. Ajit is a very close second. <laughs> but I love Ajit. He's going one person to one person to one person with that envelope. <laughs> He's got that envelope. I know where that envelope is. <laughs> You, you keep continue talking till the bulges <laughs> till the envelope expands and, and, and until he cannot close the flap on the envelope. It's, a, it's going to be exploding. It's going to ex be exploding. Yeah, yeah, don't forget Altaf. Uh, he is one. Altaf, of the, uh, just look at him. Look yeah. at that. Yeah. Yeah. And you know um, his son. Congratulations. I think he's getting married this summer. Yes. Yeah. And uh, you know many happy returns. Uh, and I see so many good friends. Vinesh uh, comes to Washington almost every week now with the art of living. He's perfected the art of flying. <laughs> and then we have, who am I missing? I, I know Srinivas, Dr. Srini Reddy is not here. Terrence, thank you for coming. Um, although Srini could not be here, his check is here. Yeah. Not really sure. His check made its way. Yeah. We'll keep that. Yeah. But in all seriousness, I, uh, I just want to say thank you from the bottom of my heart. I, um, you know, I think that uh, when my office does work on behalf of the community, and many times you are calling me late at night, you're usually not calling about yourself. Almost nine times out of ten, you are calling about somebody else. Somebody else who doesn't have a voice in the halls of power somebody else who may not have even the wherewithal whether it's language or resources or the courage to speak for themselves or you're calling for someone god forbid whose child has died i i don't know how many times you've called me merely to return the body of a child to the place of origin for last rites. I had the honor last week of receiving Sunil's message, 
where a Saudi prison had decided to hold some of my constituents. Oh my God. Wow. So I had to contact the Kingdom of Saudi Arabia via the State Department, and we were able to free these four gentlemen wow. who were wow. wrongfully persecuted. Wow. Wrongfully persecuted based on their religion. And so, um, you know, these people, the, if, I talked to them, Iftikar Bedar, um, you know, he said to me, I don't know what we would have done without you. Yeah. He said that. And all I can say is, I think my mission in life is very simple at this point. It's to help people. Wow. It's simply to help people. I, uh, I think that it, it stems from my own journey, which I've told some of you, but you know, when my parents came here, my father lost his job. Uh, but thanks to the generosity of the American people, we were allowed to move into public housing and food stamps. So I spent about half of my early childhood in those two programs. And when my father was able to get that job, get on his feet, and go to Peoria, Illinois, every night at the dinner table we said, Raja, he said to Raja and Ram, my brother and me, whatever the two of you do, just make sure this country is there for the next families who need it. Think of the greatness of this country. And so that is my mission statement. Thank you. Whatever happens, we have to be there for the next families who need it. That's what each and every one of you do every day. I know that because I get your messages, I get your emails, I get your text messages. I know in your heart you are there for the community. And I'm here for you. Thank you. Well, thank you. And so I will always be here for you. I just want to say thank you again. Uh, your resources allow us to remain on Team Normal. I am a member of Team Normal, and Team Extreme is not happy mm. on either side. Yeah. <laughs> and they came after me hard last time, from the left and from the right. But because of your support, we were able to raise and spend six million dollars defending the seat. And so that kind of support enabled us to stand up for our values and principles and for everything that we hold dear. So I just want to say thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, and I want to say um, my office is your office. The People's House is your house. And I'm just honored to be your public servant on behalf of you doing what you would otherwise do in Congress to serve the people. So thank you so much, and God bless all of you. Thank you. Thank you. Prisoners wrongfully uh, imprisoned. Thank you so much, and I think that goes on the record. Can I say one thing? Please. Please. I know that uh, Ajit Ji is trying to emancipate your money. <laughs> <laughs> so I just want to say thank you, and, uh, and, 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 and uh, thank you. It will be well used, so thank you. I second the motion. I just please continue to emancipate the, the money from the from the pockets of these wonderful people. And uh, next month more. And ladies and gentlemen, let me emph emphatically say that Raja is truly a 3 a.m. friend. You know what 3 a.m. friends is? Oh, yeah, yeah. Of course, many of you know, and many most of you know actually. So I think we I can make that informal declaration this evening that he's our 3 a.m. beloved friend. That being said, I would like to acknowledge Mr. Uh, gentleman's name, uh, Rajgarewal. Raj Garewal. Mr. Raj Garewal, thank you for coming all the way from Michigan, uh, Michigan State. Uh, we appreciate your presence. Thank you so much for your attendance. Wow. That being said, I'd also acknowledge Geeta, uh, Geeta Anjali for, the, she's going to sing the, a few songs this evening. And I, I, I hope I, I haven't missed anybody. Thank you. It's uh, special that I could have so many people at my uh, residence. Really appreciate all your help. Thank you. Thank you, Ajit. Thank you, Raj. I didn't hear. Louder! Louder! Louder!